It's happened after the senior class photo caused an uproar for its lack of social distancing and masks. Almost 1,000 students from the school district have now been told to quarantine after a COVID-19 outbreak. Stephen Fabian has details. Could this back to school class photo have sparked a COVID-19 outbreak? Etowah High School in Cherokee County, Georgia has been shut down today after dozens of students and teachers tested positive. The superintendent announced the closure on Facebook. As of this morning, there have been 59 positive COVID-19 tests confirmed, which have led us to mandate a two-week quarantine for 925 students and staff. Now, students at the school are sharing more alarming images from their first week of classes. Very few masks, little social distancing. Lisa Guerrero spoke to sophomore Jonathan Linville so and his mom, classes, Lynn. When you were in the hallways, did you feel like people were trying to keep social distance? or oh, were not they at all. Not at all. I mean, my second period, we walked out of there and we would have hundreds of people trying to pack down a singular staircase. At nearby Sequoia High School, where a similar back to school picture was taken, Spanish teacher Allison Webb has resigned in protest. I don't fault our kids. I fault our community for not effectively communicating to them the stakes and the science. And check this out at a school board meeting in Fort Worth, Texas, as they were discussing back to school protocols, a teacher resigned on the spot. So tonight, I respectfully offer you my resignation for I need to take care of my family. We caught up with Rebecca Asher, a middle school theater and yearbook teacher today. I just didn't feel um, schools were ready, that we had the adequate PPE. And there's another unexpected casualty of the COVID-19 crisis today. Dr. Pepper stores around the nation are reporting severe shortages. The company says the low inventory is a result of customers stockpiling the popular soda as they hunker down at home.